Let's write the number 12.25 as a fraction. First off, let's call it 12.25 over one. It's still 12.25, we're just dividing by one. Now we have the start of a fraction. So with two decimal places, I'm gonna multiply the numerator here by 100. When I multiply 12.25 times 100, I end up with 1,225. That's a whole number, that's what I need. But I can't just multiply the numerator here by 100, I also need to multiply the denominator. That's because 100 over 100 is one. When you divide 100 by 100, you get one, so we're just multiplying by one. We don't change the value, just the way it's represented. 100 times one, that's 100, and we have our fraction. 12.25, the decimal, equals the fraction 1,225 over 100. And we can simplify this. That's because 25 would go into 12, 25, and 100. So 1,225 divided by 25, that equals 49. And then 100 divided by 25 is four. So the decimal, 12.25 equals the fraction 49 fourths. This is an improper fraction though, because 49, the numerator is larger than the denominator here, four. Let's change it to a mixed number. Four goes into 49, 12, 12 times four is 48 with one left over, bring the four across, so 12 and one fourth. So either way, both of these are fractions for 12.25. This is Dr. B, thanks for watching.